She is 33. He turned 28 earlier this year. Together, they are the reigning world bronze medalists. Aliona, of course, also a five-time world champion with her previous partner, Robin Zolkovi, but she has continued to find success with this new partnership. Just a monstrous, monstrous triple twist. Side by side triple toes, a slight two foot from Aliona. Triple axle, the foot comes down and she fights to stay on her feet. But the starting point value is so high. But even with the mistake, it has the same value as a completed throw loop or side. A great crowd reaction in Helsinki for Aliona Savchenko and Bruno Massot from Germany. And these two have been dealing with injury this season and even on the road to recovery, they are still undeniably one of the best teams in the world. They just have such great rapport with one another. Obviously, they're incredibly powerful. They have the hardest throw in the short program with the throw triple axel and the mental strength to go after it with that being the element that she sprained her ankle on at their second stop on the Grand Prix circuit. But the excitement and the way she seems to be skating with Bruno, it's just refreshing. I think that she had gotten so content with the success that her and Robin were having that everything just kind of looked like she was at work now she looks like she's playing she's having fun their technical content is still amazing they have the biggest twist in the world it just looks like she's breathing again things and having just fun. Look, that, you know <laughs> that's something that we always say you want to have fun when you skate but it's not that easy to do at such an elite level and it just really appears that she has found her love for skating again within bruno now here's a look at the side-by-side -side triple sow cows. They're landing just a little tight, hesitant to check out the free leg. So you see that foot tap down. It's not a major mistake. Then into the throw triple axle. 
You can see her want to get that left foot down to stabilize, and it makes it very difficult to be able to come out of these throws on two feet. From a very young age, skaters learn to get over their rotating foot. For most skaters, their right foot. And check out, and that's ingrained into your muscle memory. So when you try to come down on two feet and play it safe, it's not necessarily a safer option. Perhaps it's safer on the ligaments and an injured ankle, but trying to get something that's been in your muscle memory for 30 years Trying to fight that is not an easy thing to do. Well, we saw at that Grand Prix France competition when she tore that ligament in her right ankle on the landing of that throw triple axle, the way it wrenched her foot. I wouldn't blame her for wanting to play it safe if it didn't feel perfect. And still a season's best, 79.84 for Sevchenko and Masso. She's clearly a little disappointed in what she was able to put on the ice today, but the quality of this team, what they bring to the performance and just their basic pair skills is so incredible. I could watch them any day. It's just smooth. Everything that they do is just smooth. Transition to element to transition. That cleanliness is just aesthetically pleasing.